hello all welcome to our channel all we experience so now we are going to see uh, two movie reviews uh, to watch this weekend so the first movie we are going to look is rocketry the nambi effect it is a indian biographical uh, drama film released last month and this was written directed and produced by r madhavan and it's a surprise to know that it's his directorial debut the film is based on the life of nambi narayanan played by madhavan a scientist at indian space research organization who was accused in the isro espionage and later exonerated the movie starts with uh, nambi narayanan's interview where he narrates his days as a graduate student at princeton university before exploring his work as a scientist and the false espionage charges placed upon him it is not just a biopic and a monotonous storyline The film gives us a detailed explanation about the rocket concepts, live locations and didn't get compromised with the thoughts if viewers will be able to understand the science involved. So it's a bold way of uh, taking a film and Madhavan has to be definitely appreciated for this. He did a good job in almost every department and definitely didn't look like a beginner for me. So there are many scenes that elevate the movie and uh, that's like the director's conviction is not uh, adding too much masala or uh, uh, drama cringe elements to uh, to the storyline is really appreciable. By now you would have noticed that I'm not talking much about the story or plot. Yes because this is not just a biographical film. So this is about a pain and suffering of a man not just completely about a pain and suffering again so this movie talks about rocket science and this movie talks about all the uh, people who are involved in the rocketry in ISRO and again it talks about a part of a man's life a suffering so i want everyone to experience it so that you know you will get your own own thought process about the same i don't want to rate this film as uh, this is a movie i wish everyone to experience let's not debate if this has happened or if there is a, a political motive in releasing nambi office charges even if 50% of what's shown in this movie has really happened then this man and his family should have suffered a great pain so the second review we are going to see is again a rocket but this is paper rocket So it's a Indian Tamil web series uh, with seven episodes and is directed by uh, Krithika Udayanidhi. First let me brief you uh, for whoever doesn't know about the director Krithika. So her first film Vanakkam Chennai was one of my favorite films and I have watched it a number of time. And it's a very breezy romantic comedy film. But I'm not a big fan of her second film Kali and now she is back with a bang with this Paper Rocket. It's a story about a group of people who join together at a therapy uh, session set out on a journey to fulfill their bucket list. So does this trip really uh, help them or uh, heal their past issues and uh, uh, learn more about themselves or get them into any trouble? So what surprises and hurdles they face in between forms the plot? It's a, a pretty decent storyline with an engaging screenplay. The entire first season of this series will be around uh, 3.5 hours. Uh, definitely you can watch it in a go. So it starts at a slow pace but once the character arcs were uh, established you won't find it lagging at all. Can't speak much about the technical aspects as the director sticks just a uh, what's needed for the story and didn't uh, you know try to showcase anything that's extraordinary rather uh, chooses to be more realistic coming to the performances uh, many characters has lived their part i would say uh, kalidas jayaraman has given a pretty decent act and karna agaran uh, uh, you know scored well and uh, with his comedy timings and my personal favorite character in this series is unni uh the series is full of fun and uh, few uh, cringes uh, you know add up uh, to the core plot but it's not boring or bad as i said uh, though the making of the series is not very extraordinary the characters are refreshing and relatable 
I would uh, even say this kind of series or uh, movies that cherishes positivity or much needed at this very moment where every one of us are being surrounded by negativity. The way this was filmed uh, definitely uh, deserves an applause. As in most of the Indian film or a Tamil film, uh, you must uh, have missed the beautiful side of Tamil Nadu because it is uh, always shown as a dark or even ugly <laughs> uh, place in most cases. Every place in Tamil Nadu is unique and has its own beauty. If you watch this series, uh, you would definitely get uh, what I'm trying to say. Uh, there are many more places in rest of this country which are very exotic and uh, natural. I wish many directors come up showing what it really is. Yes, this series definitely deserves an 8 uh, rating out of 10 for its neatly etched characters and a good execution of a simple heartwarming script. So guys, I would suggest you to uh, go with this series and come out about your favorite character in the comment section. You can watch Rocketry in Amazon Prime and Paper Rocket in Z5. That's it for today. I'll try to upload uh, more movies tomorrow. Please like, share and subscribe our channel. Take care. Love you all.